We have a caller already. I wonder, I'm shocked. I, wonder, I, wonder I didn't even it, say anything I yet. Who it is. Caller, I, I'm really confused, but uh, let's put you on air, caller. Caller. Good morning. I'd like. I'd like to give you the winning Powerball number. Ooh. Yeah. So if you won $1 billion, what would you spend it on? Because like I had t- said before, thank you for listening, that if you give me the lucky numbers of your choice, you could win the Powerball, right? But here's the catch that yeah. I didn't say to you. Ooh. The catch that I didn't say to you is that you have to split the winnings with us if you win with these numbers. Wow. Okay, and who's okay? So, how much you get? Thirty-three percent total. I mean, you would have to split it in a fair way with what? There's four, four of us in here, yeah, so all five, five of us would have yeah. to get a good even 20, percent. Twenty percent. Twenty percent each. Yeah. 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 I'll take thirty-three if it's higher than that. No. No, <laughs> no but in all reality, uh, yes. I, I agree. I agree to split it before you. Yeah. Correct. Yes. All right, so we would split it five ways. Yeah, 20% mm-hmm. each. Okay, great. All right, you ready? Yeah, le- but I also wanted, before you give me the numbers, right, I want to know, what are you wanting to do with the money if you won? I'm going to help you four. I'll keep all of mine. I'm going to help you four donate half of what you get to three charities of how, your choice. How come Every you get to keep all the money? Get- <laughs> well, because I'm going to organize it. Yeah. Oh, I uh, see. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's, he's, the, he's, he's the benefactor. He needs a cut, yeah. yeah he's Hold a on a minute. Let me get this straight. So we get 20%, right? I don't know how much that is out of a billion. 200. Million. Okay. Oh, wait. We're talking about a billion? Okay. You know what? Well, I'll, we'll give it to three. Everybody gets to choose three charities, and I'll put in a percentage of my winnings, and everybody else has to match whatever I choose. Oh, at the time, that's I'm fine with that. I'm fine with yeah. that. To our own charities, own charity. Yeah, you have to match. What? You have to match what he donates to his charity. So let's say you donate to St. Jude's, right? Yep. That means if I picked, uh, what is another one? I I can't think of the top make of my head wish. right now. Yeah, make like a make wish. a wish, right? So I let's say you put in three million. Does that mean we all have to equal out to pay three million? Yeah. Uh. You yeah you have to whatever I just say I put in a hundred thousand towards St Jude's then you could put in a hundred thousand towards one charity then I put in two hundred thousand to make a wish you got to put in two hundred thousand to any charity you choose yeah and then okay. if I put in fifty thousand to a third charity you put in fifty thousand to your third choice charity and each of you can choose your own charity yeah so how much money are you willing to spend on charities though. I'm not sure. It depends on the after-tax amount. It would be substantial, especially since it's uh, uh, one billion. And I may go more than three charities, to be honest with you. So it depends on the time and the rating of the charity. Very, right, like, can, very generous. Can I can I ask you a question very quick? What, what's your name? Tom. Tom. I'm going to be honest. That all sounds great, and you guys could all do that. But if I get that money, I'm going into witness protection. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm taking that all because once you start giving it away, it, it becomes a slippery slope. This person wants, this person wants. Oh, we'll do this. We'll give you dinner if you do this. And it's, I'm taking my money and running. I'm sorry. I understand what you said. Uh, you know, that's your decision. You know, and the repercussions that come with uh, not being uh, charitable is your call. Then okay. God bless you. As long as I look, as long as I have my autonomy and I get the choice, yes, I'm all good. Sounds sounds good. Okay. But you guys, you guys could do that, and if you guys want, you guys can put a little bit more of your money into it and say it's from me. If you guys wanted to do that, oh yeah, but, no. No, I'll, yeah, but I'll, I'll, I, I, I'm I'm good. I'll make you look good in the eyes of society. See, the Thank thing you. that makes me worried <laughs> is I don't know how much money that you're wanting us to donate at the end of the day because. Okay, listen, I know we're going to have billions, you know, we're going to have a billion dollars on our hands split up evenly, but at the end of the day, we're all getting X amount. And if you start putting in millions of dollars worth, then what's the point of us winning? Because then I feel I'm losing out on the money by just giving it away to people. We should make a contract. Well, why don't you pick a number that I could max out at? And one dollar. One dollar charity. Not one dollar charity. You guys can do better than that. I know it was a joke. Like I'd say, like you know, maybe ten k each. Like you know, thirty k total. 
Listen, you know how the, how some 20K. charities. You know, how but that's some not what he was saying. That's not what he was saying. He was saying 100k here, 100k there, 50 there, 30 there. No, he wants to put a lot more. No, in that. I know, that, but that's what I'm saying. We put we set the max at 30k. Max 30k is what you can donate in one charity. Tom, I'm gonna take your phone number down, but I want to hear some other options because that's just I just feel like that's a lot of money to be asking to donate. What you you're not charitable? I am, but like think about the kids. No, no, anyone you know that can help. Why don't we? I'll tell you what. Let's make it simple for this person. I forget your name, young. What's your name? Jamie. Jamie, how about two percent maximum of your uh, net uh, lottery winnings to to a charity? All right, I think That's that'll bad, fall yes. into your wheelhouse. Two percent maximum. Right? You could donate more if you want, but if you only want to be a 2%er, that's fine with you. Deal with the ramifications of that. It's $10 million, I think, if my math is correct. Um, Out of $200 million, if we're all getting, if we're splitting the billion five ways. And uh, I'm thinking about it now. I think I'll, I'll, I donate to the point where it's no. tax deductible. And the second that it's no longer tax deductible, then I'll stop. So I'll, I'll just get my taxes done, get my accounting all. All cleaned up, and that that'll be the extent of my charitable donations. Do you get See, taxed on gifts? Like, if he no. gives us this money, well, uh, first uh, we get taxed. Yeah. First of all, it's not going to be a billion. I hate to be that guy, but it will get taxed. No, yeah, he gets taxed, but then after he gets the money, after he and gifts he give, it, and then he gives it to us. Do we get? I taxed don't know. On that? Yeah. I, I still want to hear out other people, but Tom, I did take down your info. Do you still want to give me your winning numbers, or you want to hold off? Well, I'll give you the winning numbers. Yeah. Okay. Let's hear it. confidence. 10, 25, 13. How many more do I got? I believe it's five and then one Powerball, right? We're going to have David look up to make sure how many numbers you're supposed to have. Powerball? Yep. Right. Okay. Yeah, so you need, you need five numbers and then a Powerball. Okay, so you have uh, three numbers. I gave you 10. Mm-hmm. That's two numbers, right? 10, 25, 25 and 13. 13. That's six numbers. No, that's that's three different numbers. So you could pick any number, I uh, believe, yeah, up to... Two digits, yeah, yeah. 99 is the... Okay. Oh, okay, so it's two digits? Yeah. yeah. 10, 25, 13, um, 20. Mm-hmm. And... Um, what do you call it? Oh, oh wait. I think you just need the winning number, right? Or do you still you need, need one more and one then, more and then, then the, the winning number? Ball. One more number. Nine. And then six. the Powerball number. Thirty-nine. Thirty-nine. Thank you, Tom. There we go. Winning numbers, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, thank you. Can you read them back to me so I can mark them down, please? 10, 25, 13, 20, 9, and the Powerball number you chose, 39. Oh, my God, this is exciting. 10, 25, 13, 20, 09, and 39. Okay. Yep. Very good. And I think when we split it, we could all be designated winners, and they'll just take the taxes off you guys and me. Hey, okay, cool. All Thank right, you. Hey, all right, so you're buying the ticket? Yes. When's the drawing? Uh, Saturday or tonight. Thursday? Ooh, tonight. 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 Oh, so we'll know tomorrow morning. Yep. Yep. Now, should we meet at the Dunkin' Donuts if we win and, you know... Yeah, but we're going to need to go to somewhere a bit more fancy than Dunkin' Donuts. Don't worry. We will call you about it. I took down some info. Don't worry about it, Tom. I got you. But All right. Have a great day. Thanks you too. For what you guys do. Bye. Thank you. Thank you, Tom. Thank you for Thank calling, you, Tom. Tommy boy. But like I told Tom, I still want to hear someone else's winning numbers and what they would do because I'm not too fond of the charity thing. What? You See, guys don't like charity? Not See, bad. if I want. A billion dollars, but if I was in a different state, depending on how much they take out for taxes. But anyway, um, if I won a billion dollars, I would save half of it for like my schooling soon, and then like I'd half? donate half no. of it to charity. I don't think you, I don't think you have that much schooling left, do you? 
I don't know. You, if, <laughs> maybe if I wanted to go to gra- graduate school or whatever. I mean, that's still a lot for graduate A hundred million dollars? Yeah. Call 516-572-7440 if you would like to have a winning lottery ticket, but the catch here is that you have to split it with us. So call 516-572-7440. I am just curious if anybody is willing to split with us because I think this is a great opportunity and yes, we will pay for the ticket. All you have to do is give us the winning numbers. But I'm just curious though, like David, how would you go ahead and spend the money if you did win the billion? Because Linda told us how she'd spend it, so. Buy a house. That's it? House and land. The rest will... The rest we'll see. Thrustle? Yeah, the, the the rest we'll see. Okay, okay. It's the main. That's the main thing. Get it. Get situation. Nice, nice plot. You know what? I'm gonna run for president with this money. Oh, okay. Yeah. You could do it. I'd be scared. Why would you be scared? Linda really promotes the the book. Cats eat your eyeballs. That's all it'll be. Cats eat no, eyeballs. No, 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 no. That's not what it is. But okay. Mm-hmm. You do you, Jamie. You mm. do you. Yeah, you do. What would be the first law you passed? Mm. The ones where cats eat eyeballs? No, it would be for veterans, because veterans don't get a lot of stuff. You have my yeah. vote. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Liam, what about you? How would you spend the money? Pretty similar. I would fall off the face of the earth. Um, Damn. So whether you- that's buying my own island or coming up with a way like you ever drive through neighborhoods like outside of Long Island, out for the most part, like outside of New York. And there's just a street, and there's a bunch of trees, and you don't see the houses, but there are houses there. Yeah. yeah. You like mm-hmm. extreme privacy. I want to live there. I want nobody knowing where I'm at, and just the financial freedom of having unlimited money, and just, all right, I can go out to eat I in the morning. Lot, yeah, a lot of investments. I do. So the wait. afternoon, yeah. at night. Oh, yeah, index funds, yeah. Mm-hmm. ETFs. Make sure that that money works for me and real estate too. I think I think I'd invest in some like low level commercial real estate, like some offices. Yeah, I um, I go into Austin. Mm. Yeah, you know what? I feel like you. That, that, I feel like we might have missed the Austin boom though. You, I feel like we we might need to go yeah, look into t- Nashville. Tomorrow, yeah, let's look into Nashville. I feel like they're up next. They might get some sports teams. Yeah. So I do that too. I might buy a sports team or a piece of oh, one. I'm also gonna take part of that. Um, the uh, fish. The big bat, um, the bass, bass pro shop pyramid. Mm. Damn, it. yeah. It must be the billionaire outside arriving. Yeah, no, that's my helicopter. I'm out of here. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah. Liam's no, gonna yeah. join Tom, the French Foreign Legion. Tom, Tom gave the great numbers, and I'm I'm feeling confident, so I already ordered the blade helicopter out of here. Oh, yeah. so. shoot, Good you're ahead you. of the game. Yep. See, I'm out of here, guys. <laughs> for me Bye. personally, with the the money, if I were to win, I would want to put stuff into i want to put it into different like types of i forgot what they're called but into different types of saving funds so that way the money can accumulate over time like an ira yeah so then that way like my future generations (laughs) would be able to still obtain the money and i would put it in their name no they're laughing because they think I'm talking about the terrorist IRA. We were, we were talking about we, it. Yeah. We were talking about it earlier. The IRA. No, there's like no, there's like funds that like you can have, and then like when you're 18 or whatever, they transfer over to your name, yeah. and like that money is yours, but you can't touch it until a certain year. I have one of those, and well, I would that's a, like a CD, I think. I don't know what they are, but like deposit, at the but, end of the day, I still want to give that to my family, and they also have like bonds that you can have, and then you can open them after they expire. I like to put money into those. And open a hedge fund. They yeah, just print money. There you go. I'm also thinking like I definitely want to travel because you only live once. I want to go see the world. I want to go see what's out there. Experience yeah. new people, new food, but new places. Hmm. But you could die. You could die sitting in your house. I'm fine with that. Okay. I'd rather. See, I'd, I. I gotta see the world. I, I want to see what's wa- going on out watch- there. If I was watching, you know, Matrix for the fiftieth time, <laughs> and I just died. I'd be fine with that. I want to try new experiences. I want to try and go out there. I think I would also just buy a radio station and... Have your own morning show? Ha- not only that, but I would like to try and make it my own. Put a little different twist on it and see how it works. Play your own music? Yes, and I would also donate money to Nassau Community College. 100% would. Yeah, they've, they've, they've raised me a bit, you know. Well, I definitely got my start at radio here. Got to give him a little bit of a pat on the back for doing that. I would also give our director some money because he has helped us become this great radio station that it is. And I also feel like, uh, you know what? 
I feel like, you know, maybe maybe we could just do a Wheel of Fortune. Be like, you get money, you get money. Just be Oprah. Yeah, maybe. But like, yeah. and Sean, <laughs> Sean's the best, but would he? if he won, would he give us any money? Or would that be the last time we saw Sean? I know he'd give me money. He, I don't know about you guys. Yeah, no, he wouldn't give know. you money. He, he would just be like, bye, see you later, maybe, never coming maybe back. You, maybe you think he's giving you money, but... Yeah. If he yeah. doesn't give me money, I know where he lives, so he I can know. take that with He's not going to live there much longer yeah. if he wins. He's, <laughs> yeah. He better give me something. He's got a, he won't give he's you anything. How do you know? He doesn't owe you anything. Why don't you get the man from outside and bring him in? That's probably him calling. I hope so. He does not owe you anything. I hope that he is. Caller, you are now on air. I am so touched that Jamie and <laughs> Cher were winning with me. Oh, Sean, please that tell is, me you would. That is such a... T- I'm, Jamie, I have such a new, newfound respect for you today. <laughs> what the hell does that mean? <laughs> I, he didn't I previously don't, respect I, 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 I just I did not put you as a person that would share your winning with someone like me the hell does that mean i don't understand why wouldn't i because if i won that money you'd never see me again sean you're kidding i mean i'd give a little bit to the radio station because it is that we are a charity we are a non-profit organization so i'd make my charitable donation but in return i wanted to now be renamed w H A yeah. or Sean's mm-hmm. radio station mm-hmm. because I will now own it. Um, I want my name on the studio door. I want my face plastered everywhere. It so is already made it is that donation. Plastered. Yeah, and uh, and then I will uh, leave you guys because I'd go buy some kind of mansion in the Bahamas and uh, live a very happy, rich life. He's Bahamas. trying to be no, the Bahama Mama. It's Yo, like all those I'm, cryptocurrency guys. Yeah, crypto- I'm, I would not, I, I'm so I would disappointed. Not I would not give a penny to any of you in that room right now. Ooh, See what? you later, sucker. Good, I don't want your money. I don't want your money. Yo, I just want you to care. You went from someone <laughs> super respectful to a complete jackass. <laughs> uh, I'm a rich jack jackass. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I have to put you up there with Jack Black, don't I? Listen, everybody thinks it. Sean says it. Yeah. I'm upset. I am so upset. I actually hope you win something, because I want to see you follow through with that promise. Well, I mean, I feel like you've ruined your chances. I feel like I shouldn't give you anything now. Personally, Sean. But you said it. Uh -uh. You said it, so if it happens... That doesn't mean I have to Uh, do everything I say. Personally, Sean, I don't owe you anything, and you don't owe me anything. Well, if I don't have to do everything I say, then, Jamie, I would give you 50 gazillion dollars if I win. But I don't have to do it, because if I say it, I don't have to do it. 50 gazillion. So, Sean, are you going to give us the Powerball ticket numbers? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Thank you, Sean. Okay, Sean, what is your Powerball winning numbers? Was that a finished sentence? Yeah. Um, So, long story short, Jamie, you're a nice person, me. See you later, alligators. I'm going to the Bahamas! I'm going to send the FBI after you. He didn't even give me the winning numbers. I'm going to... He'll hang up and listen. Yeah. (sighs) He's always listening. I'm going to call the FBI on him and say that he has personal... um, some st- substance in his house that shouldn't Bro, be in his house. I can't. I can't swat believe him. that he wouldn't even help. <laughs> he he wouldn't help a sister out. Help See, we're going to try to swat out. him for you, Jamie, so you can get his money. Flashbang. FBI, Bro. open up. <laughs> yeah, please. I'm going to play Rainbow Six <laughs> FBI. <in his> house. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe that. Like, this is beyond my wildest dreams. I always thought that we'd be partners in crime, Sean and I, and... Well, you thought well, you wrong. Can, you, I mean, if you guys don't win, you guys can still be partners in crime. Um, oh, I'm going to beat his ass more, after the show, even tomorrow. Can I just say, mm. um, I want to give Powerball ticket numbers because, you know. You? Yeah. But you're in the room. That, mean, that doesn't make sense. You'd and, have to share it with all of us then. And? And? Are you willing to actually do this? Yeah. Are you Ooh. sure? Yes. Wow, Linda. Powerball tickets? Yeah. You're okay. welcome. Okay, okay. You guys you, ready? You want your yeah, winning numbers uh, out? Yeah, you guys want your winning numbers? Take out your phones. Yeah. If you, <laughs> By the way, if you guys are in oh. the gas station, uh, we own these numbers. You guys can't call them. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, we have another caller. Maybe, Linda, I'm sorry. Caller, what is your uh, name? This is John from Freeport. How are you? Yeah, John hey, from John. Freeport. What's up, John? <laughs> yeah. My lucky number is 22, and yes. um, 
Yes. I appreciate Sean's honesty, but I have a different uh, topic. It's the um, the Fast Car song, and this is sort of on behalf of that country More host, along? Linda no, Ann, Luke Linda Combs, Sue, whatever. Whoever's does the Whoever's fast car. singing it, it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! yeah! John from Freeport! You know, they like Selena Gomez, and they always used to make you play that Selena Gomez Song in the morning. John. Like, John. I love John. I love Freeport. John from Freeport. John. Love you, John. No, wait, John. Don't go anywhere. I want to know what are you doing with this money? <laughs> Instead of bashing oh, okay. the songs, I want to know what are you going to do with a billion dollars? Because I want your winning numbers. Because I want to do some teamwork here with you. Uh, I'm going to take you all out to dinner and see who's the friendliest. Yeah. yeah. What do you mean by the friendliest? Well, like, I'll give, I'll give you a piece. I'll give you guys a piece. Of course, you, you're always good to me, but I want to address the Morgan Wallen thing. I don't want to oh hear that. Yeah. Yeah. I think, it, I think whoa, by the whoa, way, the whoa, fast whoa, car... Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't pick on Morgan Wallen. I was just picking on Luke Combs. Yeah, to be <laughs> oh, fair. No, I, I, oh, Luke, it's Luke Combs. You're it's right. Luke Combs, know. Morgan yeah. Wallen's got his own issues. I'm not sure what he said, but... <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Uh, you know, he just doesn't show up to concerts anymore. Just you guys hurts. shouldn't have to play. You guys shouldn't have to play off a reel. If if you want to fast forward the song, you should be able to. That's yeah. that's you know that's college radio. That's free form radio. We're not a corporation. We're not getting bucks. So uh, maybe Sean will address that at some point. I assume he's still listening. So um, yeah, tell John tell for director. They don't, play, <laughs> they, they don't have to play fast car. If you don't like fast car, don't play it. If you don't like Selena Gomez, don't play it. You're the DJ. That's that's supposed to be a DJ's job i know it's transformed in the present day but yes. and good luck good luck on the lottery thanks for letting me rant uh no you are gonna give me your winning numbers you're not getting away with this john <laughs> i gave you 22 i thought i was just gonna give you have to give me four numbers um 15 3 8 and two okay and your winning number was what again 22 22 the lucky is that number. enough or you got one more no yeah you're good you're good all right good luck thanks thank luck you, to you john from freeport wait what were the numbers again oh my god linda i think i like john's uh method better than tom's i don't john, know i'll see you at the nautical mile Mean. I'll buy you a drink. Mm. <laughs> you buy him a drink? Yeah. Me and going? John will go places. <laughs> Hurricane Harry's? <laughs> <laughs> Me and John will go places. We'll go to Nashville together and tell them to stop playing Fast Car by Luke Combs. <laughs> Are you, you're kidding, right? I'm not kidding. I actually hate that song. It's so overrated, and it was oh. hyped for no reason. Well, I got some news to tell you. Guess what we're playing now. It's what? Fast Car? Fast Car? We're playing some fast car. Oh my god. On 90.3 WHPC, just for you, John. Enjoy. <laughs>